2023 Ford Ranger and Raptor photos reveal the U.S. version testing uh, with a Bronco Warthog. Now, redesigned from the ground up, the T6 vehicle architecture, the 2011 Ford Ranger, has served the Blue Level quite well. The Ford Motor Company made a case for the Raptor as well. But for some reason or another, the off-road pickup isn't available in the United States. Now, because the Ranger is 10 years old, in 2021, the Dearborn-based automaker is working day and night on the next generation of the mid-sized truck. Now, on this particular occasion, the Blue Oval is testing a Raptor in the United States with the Bronco Warthog in tow. And the sighting isn't a coincidence. For starters, the Bronco is based on the letter frame chassis developed for the all-new Ranger. Secondly, the Raptor and the Warthog are pretty much the same vehicle under the same skin. Must I say not the same skin, but different skin, same vehicle. Similarities include the BF Goodwrench All-Terrain TA KO2 rubber shoes, very expensive, and a Smart Fox shock absorbers. And a kind of ground clearance that won't disappoint you if you're going off-road and off the beaten path. Now equipped it with the dual tip exhaust system that flanks the full-size spare wheel under the bed, the Ranger Raptor for the United States market is referred to as the Project Redback under P703 codename. Although camouflaged, this prototype fails to completely mask the Ford lettering on the front grille. I don't have that here because they're covered in camouflage and everything like that. And camouflage don't get many views. I'd rather just show the Ford Bronco and, show, and then you can think of you know, what they're doing with it. Now, the car paparazzi highlights nearly identical engines and exhaust notes, referring to the six cylinders and the force induction. That's what they notice on the both the, uh, the uh, Ranger and also the Bronco. And when I say the Ranger, I mean a Raptor, and the Bronco, I mean a Warthog. Now, what's not exactly clear is what the EcoBoost V6 hides under the hood of the Ranger Raptor and the Bronco Warthog. But there are two candidates you should take into consideration. Simply speaking, the 2.7 liter engine of the Bronco is capable of more suck and squeeze and bang and blow from the factory. But on the other hand, the 3.0 liter engine of the Explorer ST is a great choice as well because of its compact packaging and 400 ponies and 415 pound feet of torque is awesome. Now as for the European specification, of the Ranger Raptor, the Ford Motor Company is expected to switch from the gasoline fuel V6 to the Eco Blue uh, by turbo diesel with the two two liter displacement, similar to the 2021 model year. Now, the next generation may drop the very capable BF Goodrich in favor of the General Grabber AT3 tires, produced by Continental Tire, South Africa. That is. Now, this is just awesome, folks. We just we take a look at the Bronco, and we also take a look. At the Ford Ranger. And we see both of the faces. They're both the same company. I just wanted to show a quick glimpse. But I wanted to go back to the Warthog. And we know the Warthog and the Ford Ranger. Uh, one's the same because of the T6 platform. You guys, it's been great. Uh, talking about the 2023 Ford Ranger. Uh, photos reveal the U.S. version. Testing with the Bronco Warthog. This is just a lot of anticipation, guys. A Automotive Review. Thanks for watching. Remember, like, share, and subscribe. Hi, this is Bruce from AO Automotive Reviews, encouraging you to subscribe, to like, and to continue watching these videos. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to putting out a lot more great content. Thanks for watching and subscribing. Much love. Peace out.